Hey everyone, welcome to my channel and welcome to another edition of Subscription Box Sunday. Today, I have six different things to share with you guys. First, I have the Vela box for May. Then I have the Lips and Lather box for May. The Medusa's makeup box for May. The 180 degree box for May. Some City Beauty PR. And a brand new Pepper bra. If you're new to my channel, welcome. My name is Katrina and I am a sub box lover. I love to share subscription boxes with all of you sub box lovers out there. So if you like subscription boxes, unboxing videos, lifestyle videos, things like that, go ahead and subscribe and join the Subbox Lover family. And without further ado, let's jump in the boxes. So on Sundays, I like to unbox multiple different boxes at once so that you can see a lot in one video. And we will kick things off with the Vela Box for May. If you're unfamiliar with Vela Box, they are a monthly candle subscription where each month you get a candle and a free gift. There are three different size subscriptions. This is sent to me free for review. They send me the biggest one, which is a 16 ounce candle. There's then an eight ounce candle or a four ounce candle if you want a cheaper subscription. This is somewhere in the $30 range. I'm thinking like higher $30. I think their prices are a little bit hard to figure out. I think the four ounce candle is like $13, somewhere around there. I could be wrong in prices, but obviously the bigger candle, the more expensive. Um, um, I do have a coupon code down below where you can get 50% off your first um, box, which is really, really awesome. And you do get to curate the scents for your profile or your preferences, or the scent is curated based on your profile. So now they do have a scent profile that you fill out. So you can say, I like florals. I don't like woodsy, all that kind of stuff. Um, and they will pick a candle based on your profile. Now, because this is sent to me free for review, I got to just pick the candle that I wanted. So I'm really excited to share it with you guys. When you open it up, this is what it looks like. It says here, the more grateful I am, the more beauty I see, Mary Davis. And then they do have started including a Spotify playlist for the month, which is so awesome. So each month the candle comes in a little pouch. This one is super pretty with the floral kind of neutral colors on it. So each month there is a featured candle maker. This month is Sincerely Sarah Jane out of Seattle, Washington. I'll read a little bit about the brand. So it says it st all started with the goal of creating candles that were clean burning and didn't contain toxins that mainstream candles had. Owner Sarah began creating clean candles with her mom in mind, who was going through cancer treatments at the time. She wanted to provide a warm and cozy environment without compromising her health. Out of a creative outlet came a business with community, empowerment, and generosity at the core. SSJ is all about random acts of kindness for their community and giving back to cancer research. Sarah looks forward to continuing to grow her business with their guidance of her customers, who she calls her friends. Awesome. Um, now it used to list all of the scents you could have received this month. It only lists the one that I got. So this is the candle that I got and the scent is dream. So this has notes of lavender, cedarwood, and vanilla. This is for fans of herbal and spice type candles. So it says in this dream, we don't want to wake up, close your eyes and let this scent take you to your happy place. We're seeing lavender fields of plenty and the beauty of spring all around. Okay, let's give this a smell. I'm really excited. I try to switch up like the scent profile of like what I get each month if I can. Ooh, oh, I like that. A lot of times when you get a lavender or when I've gotten lavender candles, it smells very like cleaning product lavender. This smells like baked good lavender. This smells like, oh, you get kind of like this, like, I don't know, baked good lavender, maybe because of the vanilla. And it kind of has like a cinnamony spice type of scent to it. It does say for fans of herbal sweet and spice. So there's some sort of spice note, um, though it's not the main notes because it's lavender, cedar, wood, and vanilla, but this smells really good. Mmm, I like this a lot. It's a different. I don't have any candles that smell like this. I also really like the packaging, the nice little um, metal white lid and the, the um, font is super cute. Okay, very, very yummy. Then there's always the free gift. The featured bonus brand this month is Joy Creative out of Dallas, Texas. 
Um, it says, gratitude is the best kind of attitude. List making can keep you sane-ish and a sweet note can completely make someone's day. That's the idea behind this fun and functional personalized stationery company. They create colorful cards, notepads, planners, wrapping, and more with custom personalization options. They firmly believe in the simplest things that inspire the greatest joy. And their goal as a, uh, as a brand is to help you find unique ways to express gratitude throughout your day. So we got a little stationary item. These, these are little, don't forget, little notes. They're not sticky notes, but they're actually like pretty thick paper. Do I have more than one? Oh, I have more than one. Still pretty nice and thick, super duper cute. So these are the Don't Forget Memo notepads. It says, we had so much fun creating this notepad with Joy Creative Shop to match the May Vela box. Everyone can use a cute visual reminder to get them through the day, whether that is to pick up milk at the grocery store or to slay the day, we're here for it. So super duper fun. This was a really, really great Vela box for May. I really enjoyed it. There Again, there were other scents, so if this scent doesn't really speak to you there were other options as well but definitely let me know your thoughts down in the comments below and if you get this box which scent did you get this month all right up next let's jump into the lips and lather box by cut the crap organics i've unboxed this maybe once or twice on my channel before but it was at least a year ago i believe um this is a monthly bar of soap and um lip balm subscription this box is 13 dollars a month um but if you're international you can still get the box it's just 26 dollars a month so if you are outside of the united states that is an option as well so i'm curious to get inside all right so this is what the box looks like <gasps> oh Okay, the bar of soap is gorgeous. I remember the one I got last time. Okay, so it says here, it's that wonderful time of year, time to drag the lawnmower out and nearly dislocate a shoulder trying to get the thing started, time to dig out the dandelions that are bent on world domination, then perhaps after all that backbreaking work, you can relax in the shade with a glass of lemonade and survey your manicured space. This month, it's all about yard work. Fresh cut grass soap. Ooh, okay, wait, so let's look at the soap before we talk about it because look at this bar of soap, y'all. It is gorgeous. So this is what it looks like. And when you like move the, can I move this off? I'm trying to figure out how do I, <laughs> yeah, it just, this is what it looks like. It looks like little grass and then it has this, it smells like fresh cut grass. So it says here, fresh crust, Fresh cut grass soap is scented with a blend of fresh juniper and lemon with a base of earthy cedar wood. Um, and then there's another the lip balm product. Um, I'm not the biggest fan of the smell of fresh cut grass, but I can, this one smells okay kind of just smells fresh. The, I just love the creativity of the bar of soap. The last one that I got, oh, there's sparklies on top. Oh, I love that. The last one I got was little carrots in a garden and it was adorable. So you saw that there are three different carrots and then it had a little like carrot top sticking out. So these are like, when I say these are like bars of soap, these are really cool, like artistic artisan bars of soap. Okay, yum, yum, yum. And then you get your lip balm. This one is in fresh squeeze lemonade. Ooh, oh my goodness. That really, doesn't, it really smells like lemonade and not just like lemon. So it says, lemonade lip balm is a juicy tube of zesty moisturizing goodness that may just become your new favorite. It says, I hope you enjoyed this yard work themed box. And on that, it inspires you to get outside with your gloves on. Ooh, I love this. I, this box is so fun. Uh, the bars of soap are stunning. Like this is probably the prettiest bar of soap I've ever, 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 ever owned in my life. And I love it. Scent, I'm not a big fan of like the cut grass, but I'm obsessed with this one. Um, but if you like, I know a lot of people do love that, so you'd be obsessed. I love this subscription. I think it's super cute. You can help out a little small owned business. So I will leave a link down below. It's a great price, $13. Um, and you get some really, really awesome products inside. So definitely be sure to check them out. All right, up next, let's jump into Medusa's makeup. This is a monthly cruelty-free and vegan beauty subscription. It tends to be fairly makeup heavy. And inside you get five products a month. It does say bonus item. It has a sticker that says bonus item on it. So I guess there's a bonus item in here as well. This box retails for $22.95 a month. Um, this is sent to me free for review. The um, Lips and Lather was sent to me free for review too. I don't think I said that. Um, this was sent to me free for review and the, they do ship internationally. So if you're international, you can definitely check them out as well. So let's jump inside. All right, so there's just like a lot of stuff inside. I, I'm thinking this is the regular beauty box and then there's some stuff outside. Um, so it says coming in June, the rainbow beauty box. And then coming in August is the birthday beauty box. So those are some upcoming themes. Then there's a, maybe there's a Foxy Bay product because there's a card about Foxy Bay. And this is the festival season care package box. Um, this comes with five 
premium beauty products valued at $61.90, so a cool value inside. And then I believe this is a bonus product because it's not listed on the card. This is from Plant Fusion, and this is their complete plant collagen builder in creamy vanilla bean. It's the world's first plant-based triple action formula that builds, hydrates, and protects collagen. Very cool. So I'm assuming that's the bonus product. And then it comes in this super cute Medusa's makeup bag. It's got that like popping stuff, but it's like purple hearts. And I love this kind of bag because it is the kind that's like, you can put like a product in it and if it spills or it's liquid, um, you can just wipe it out or wash it out because of the packaging. All right, the very first thing is from Medusa's Makeup and this is their Vegan Lip Balm and Takeout, which retails for $14. Medusa's Makeup is a makeup line, so they have their subscription box, but you can always just go on their website and um, just go and purchase makeup as you want versus getting it in a subscription. Okay, so this is what the packaging looks like. I think it's metal. Ooh, this is very pretty. It's kind of like a shimmery pink. Is it shimmery? It's just like shiny. I don't know if it's truly shimmery. It does look like there's some pearlescence in it. It doesn't really come, there wasn't any pigmentation on my hand really there other than the pearlescence. So it's a nice kind of basic lip balm. I don't think this is metal. There might be parts of this that are metal, but it's kind of like a matte um, plastic. This is new packaging for them. Normally it looks a little different, but I really, really like that. Love a good lip balm. So I'm very excited to get this. Then we have a Medusa's Makeup Liquid Eyeshadow in Grace, which retails for $14. I'm curious to see the shade. They tend to like test you with the shades to push you out of your comfort zone. Oh my goodness, yes. It is a purple liquid eyeshadow. Super fun. Um, I love that it pushes you out of your comfort zone. You will get fun out there colors in this box. So if that's not your thing, then you may just wanna go to their website and purchase the colors that you prefer versus getting the subscription. But if you like to be tested and you like to try new things, this is so fun. This is gorgeous and stunning. Oh, I like that. I don't wear a lot of liquid eyeshadow, but I feel like for a color like this, this would be perfect. Okay, another Medusa's makeup product. This is their eye dust. Um, and this is in the shade Rising Sun. This retails for $9, so it's basically a loose pigmented powder. So this one's just kind of like a gold champagne color. I actually really like this one. Um, I'm not somebody who reaches for like potted eyeshadows because I prefer palette, it's just easier and all that kind of stuff, but I actually really do like this shade. Um, so super duper fun. Ooh, this is a new brand. I've never heard this. This is from Jelly Pong Pong Bear Necessities, and this is their highlighting pencil, which retails for $17.95. It doesn't have a shade name, so I'm guessing there might just, there's only one shade for this. Okay, so this is what it looks like. So it kind of looks like a skin toned kind of pink color. I'm not seeing any specific shimmer. Um, I don't know if this would work as a highlighter for me just because I'm so pale. This would almost, this wouldn't highlight for me. I'm not sure. I'll have to play around with this. This seems like a really, really interesting product. I don't know if you use this, is this on the eyes? Ah, it's an emollient highlighter, eyeshadow base, water liner, and concealer in one. Ooh, actually, I love that. Okay, so this is like an all-in-one really, I love that. That's gonna be really fun to play with. I love the kind of concealing, you can use it in a water line. Okay, all right, I, at first I was not very sure about it, but actually, I'm feeling it. And then last but not least, we do have a Foxy Bay product. I figured since there is a kind of pamphlet about them in here. This is their 12-in-1 Magic Daily Leave-In Hair Mask. Um, and this retails for $6.95. It says go from magic, uh, it says go from tragic to magic with our 12-in-1 Daily Magic Leave-In. Add this to your travel routine to keep your locks nourished and add that glow to the skin you deserve, or the, the glow that you deserve, not to your skin. This is, it is sealed, but you can smell it through. The package and it smells really really good it has um manoi oil shea butter orisa sativa protection i like i probably don't pronounce that right argan oil baobab extract macadamia oil coconut oil amila oil or amla oil tospaki oil pitanga oil biotin and kukui oil I don't know if I said that right, but you apply a quarter size amount onto damp hair from the middle of the strand and work your way down and you leave it in your hair and it will work its magic all day long and it will make your hair smell so good. This smells so sweet and yummy and great. So if anything, it's a little hair perfume and I, with benefits obviously, so very cool. So that was everything in the Medusa's makeup box for May. I thought it was a good box. I'm most excited about the Foxy Bay and the lip balm, but the other products are really cool. I love getting the purple eyeshadow because it's gonna push me out of my comfort zone and I love that. All right, up next, let's jump into the 180 degree box for May. This is such
such a fun box. I love this box. This is what I would consider a monthly lifestyle box. It has self-care, love, and wellness items in it. So snacks, home decor, beauty, all that kind of stuff. Last month we got these beautiful bowls. So I'm so excited to jump in it today. This box is $49 a month plus $7.99 shipping within the US. It comes with six to nine products for the mind, body, and soul. And the value of the box should be about $120 or more. Um, now this box is sent to me free for review and I do have a coupon code down below where you can get 15% off your first box. When you open it up, that is what it looks like. On top, there's a cute little butterfly with like flowers in it. This is a wildflower blend seed paper. You plant flat under a fourth of an inch of soil and you keep moist and remember to give them some sun and enjoy. Oh, that's really pretty. Oh, I love that. That is super fun. And a theme for May is wildflower. On the inside, it talks about all of the products inside. So first there's a little note. So it says, why a wildflower? Because you're not modified and you are your true authentic self, like a flowering plant that has not been genetically manipulated. You can always be blooming and growing on in your own way in any environment. Always remember how unique and special you are. Uh, and you are one in a million in the garden of wildflowers. Well, that's really, really awesome. Let's jump in. I'm so excited to see the stuff inside. Ooh, okay, the first thing I'm pulling out is a snack. So y'all know I'm happy about this. This is from Stellar Braids, and these are their Maui Monk Vegan Butter Braided with Maui Moi Onion Style Seasoning and Monk Fruit. Okay, well, <laughs> I like the idea of pretzels, but I don't know about onion and monk fruit together. I have no idea, okay. So it says vegan baked pretzels, a crafty and flavorful buttered braided delight with Maui onion style seasoning and monk fruit. You will not only enjoy this snack, but also the wildflower packaging and all its beautiful glory. Okay. I, I really don't know how I feel about that flavor combo, but I'm really excited to try these and there's always a fun snack in this box. Okay, there's also another snack and this one I'm obsessed with. This is from Mama Loretti's and this is their um, tiramisu cream filled corn wafers. So it says here, these cream filled snacks are delicious, 100% gluten free wafer snacks made with a corn shell, perfect for when you're on the go or as a light pick me up. It's filled with creamy flavored chocolate. Okay, well, I love these type of like creamy filled wafer things. So we're starting off with the snacks and those are incredible or they sound incredible at least. Ooh, okay, this is so pretty. This is just got like flower petals inside of it. This is from Beauty Papier or Beauty Paper, and I think it's Papier, I don't know. Daisy Toner. So it says here, flowers for a flower, get that extra beauty skincare with this infused floral toner with real chrysanthemum flowers, a traditional herbal medicine that will gently purify, tone, hydrate, and soften the skin. This natural formula is alcohol free and can be used morning or evening. That is stunning packaging. I don't know how good it's coming across on camera, but I love that. I love the little like, lid here. I wonder, does it smell? Oh, it's sealed. Um, but I love this. I do need a new toner and like this, I love that. Like it's kind of gel like, so like the, I love that the, they're staying dispersed amongst the bottle versus going to the top or the bottom. That is very cool. Okay. This is very interesting. This is from spa life and this is their power makeup brush. Uh, interesting. It's a flat powder brush head and a round liquid brush head. Okay. So this is bring the spa feel to your home with this power brush. Blend your way to a photo ready finish with the Spa Life's Power Spin Makeup Brush featuring two interchangeable brush heads and an ergonomic handle for comfort and control. This multifunctional brush spins and helps effortlessly apply your favorite liquid and powder foundations. <gasps> okay, I don't know if I'm gonna keep this, so I'm not gonna like take it out of the packaging, but that is very, very cool. It needs one AA battery. So basically you have this handle and then you can put the brush head on top and it like spins to help blend it. I don't, the reason why I'm not gonna open this, I tend to like, I don't use liquid products with a brush. I use a beauty blender. So I haven't decided if I'm going to keep this or not yet or if I'm going to put it in giveaway. But honestly, that sounds like such an awesome product that I kind of want to play around with it. It sounds really fun. That is very cool. The next thing out is this here, which is a makeup bag, I believe. I think it just needs to be like, oh, this is very pretty. And it does flatten out on the bottom as well. So just a little makeup bag. This is from Estella Green, and this is their cosmetic bag. Um, on it, it says, ju just l'essentiel. I don't know. I think it's in French. I don't, I'm not sure. Um, so it says this floral cosmetic bag will have you feeling light and airy like a spring garden. Each time you use it, take all your essentials in the spacious cosmetics bag 
on your dream weekend. Evening out or use it in any way you wish as they are so fashionable and eye-catching like wildflowers. Ooh, very cool. Okay, let me open this up. Ooh, okay, so it's just black lined on the inside. Nothing super special, but it is a really cute bag. I like the shape and the size. It's a good size. It is very, very pretty and very on theme for the box. Next up, we have a product from Bella Pierre Cosmetics, and this is their lip palette. Ooh, okay. Let's, I'm like curious what this looks like. Ooh, let me not drop that. Okay, very cool. So it comes with all these different shades that you can use, and it does come with a little brush applicator as well. So it says, make a statement with colors to represent the wildflower in you. Bella Pierre's Matte Pro Lip Palette features 12 unique matte lipstick shades in a convenient mirrored palette, which includes a dual lip brush. It lasts all day and is paraben and non-toxic. Ooh, that's very cool. The other cool thing about this is you could mix these colors to make new colors. So that's really cool. Like you could mix like the blue and yellow to make a green and, and fun stuff like that. So that is super duper awesome. Tons of fun and colors to play with. Not that I would do a green lip look, I'm just realizing that now, but it's still really cool. The next thing out is this here. This is from Way of Will, and this is their cuticle serum. And this is what it looks like. It says, get glowing, revitalized nails and cuticles with this nail serum. It has effective ingredients of lavender, geranium, and ylang ylang essential oils, a powerful, effective blend for nails and cuticles that encourages nail growth and will naturally moisturize, making the perfect cuticle serum. A very, very cool. I'm lazy about taking care of my nails, but cuticle serum is always a good thing to have on hand. I have a lot of like hangnails and things that I probably need to like use cuticle oils to help with. So very handy. Then to go along with that, we have, oops, let me just knock the whole box. We have this here. This is from Ravel and this is a manicure set. So it comes out with lots of fun because like tweezers, like the, the cuticle pushers, nail clippers, and it's in a really beautiful case that you can kind of snap together and take for travel, which is really, really awesome. Um, so it says, get your nails cute and pampered with this multifunctional nail set you can use with your cuticle serum. It's a portable manicure set that comes with a portable, fashionable, lightweight case that makes it easy to take everywhere. And it's like I said, it's got a beautiful floral thing and it feels really, really nice. So that is really fun. All right, then we have a product from Three Ships and this is their lip treatment set. So it comes with a vanilla lip exfoliator and a buttercream hydrating lip mask. Yum. So this is what they look like. They come in frosted glass. I do think I've gotten these before, but I don't know if I've used them yet or not. So this is what they look like. Um, it says here, oh my God, it looks like my eyes. <laughs> Sorry, <laughs> I'm a kid. Okay, so it says, just like blooming flowers, let your lips bloom with this lip scrub and moisturizer. Use this two-step approach to exfoliate, then use the buttercream hydrating lip mask to encourage cell growth for plump, luscious lips that know how to take on hydration just like a wildflower. Super fun. I am very excited about these. If I already have them and I saved them, then I'll put these in a giveaway. I can't remember if I put the ones that I got before in a giveaway, but I love that. Okay, so that was all the regular stuff in the box, but you do always get a little bonus charm. So let's see what it is this month. Ooh, okay, so the wildflower paper is one of the bonuses. And then we have these here. Um, these are little fashion earrings. It looks like you could have gotten them in maybe different colors, but I got mine in like a really light pink color. Those are actually really pretty. They kind of match my skin tone a little bit, but I think they're really, really pretty. So cute. So that was everything in this month's 180 degree wildflower box. I thought it was a really, really good box. Definitely kind of a take care of yourself, spa, wellness kind of box this month. Um, but I'm excited about the snacks. I think I'm probably most excited about this toner because I just think it's so beautiful. This looks so beautiful, like out on your counter, or your vanity, whatever you, wherever you put your skincare products. So it's super cute. But I love that you get the nail products, the lip products, the multiple lip products. Um, you get the face brush, the case, the snacks. So much fun. So definitely let me know what was your favorite product in the box. All right. Up next, I have two different products from City Beauty to share with you guys. They were sent to me in PR, so I did not pay for these. Um, and I'm really excited. I really love some of the City Beauty products before. I included some of their products in a previous um, subscription box Sunday, I believe. And I used up the, um, one of their creams and I'm obsessed. I'm actually gonna have to repurchase some here soon. I do have a coupon code down below where you can get 15% off your order sub box 15. So if either of the two products that I talk about today interest you, or you just want to go look at some of their other products, you can use it on anything on their website. And I really genuinely have loved some of the products that I've tried from them. So the first product that they sent me is the skin lifting booster. Um, so this helps you enjoy tighter, firmer, and more sculpted looking skin 
the skin. So let's pull this out. Their packaging is so cute. It's got this kind of like gold and dark blue vibe going on. And this one, that's kind of what the packaging looks like there. So this is what it looks like. Um, so this instantly creates a tightening and lifting effect and increases the look of skin's firmness and elasticity and be can mixed with other formulas to amplify the results. It also reduces the look of sagging on the face, jawline, and neck. I feel like I need to use this on my neck because my neck just, it's getting kind of wrinkly and I am not the biggest fan of this, um, or the fan of my neck, not the product itself. <laughs> So the nice thing about this product is that it mixes really, really well into other serums and products. So you can kind of mix it together. Um, it says you can mix it with any liquid or cream product, including other serums, moisturizers, face creams, and even liquid makeup like foundation. You can simply add two to three drops into your liquid or cream product and mix thoroughly with clean fingers. Um, I think you could also just apply it as is. So one of their tips is to add it to liquid foundation. Um, you can apply it on its own after cleansing and tonings as a boost. And you can of course mix it with other products. Um, and you can also mousse the mixer, mixer with your desired product on the back of your hand to warm it up and then fully combine it. So really, really fun. I'm excited to play around with this, particularly targeting my neck area, I think. Maybe my forehead wrinkles, we shall see, but super cool. A lot of their products kind of have help with the anti-aging and all that kind of stuff. Um, I really loved the, their cream, I think it was the Invisic Crepe Body Cream. That's the one I wanna repurchase. I use it on my legs and it, they, like, my legs aren't wrinkly. <laughs> Um, but it just made them, it definitely made them feel more toned. It smelled so good. And so I'm definitely have to repurchase some of that. So that's one of my favorites from them. Then the other thing that they sent me is their Redensifying Brow Serum. So this is what it looks like. It has just a little wand with a serum for your brows. So this here enhances the look of darker, fuller brows. It nourishes brow hairs for a thicker look and it helps fill in the appearance of sparse patches. It also conditions the brows to avoid breakage, which is great. So this is a little bit different from, from maybe some other brow serums that you've used. So other brow serums tend to have prostaglandins, which is a chemicals that are known for their kind of, they sometimes have permanent side effects and they're a little bit more harsh. Um, this uses targeted peptides that help brows look dramatically fuller, longer, and more defined. Um, you should use this two times per day, morning and evening after cleansing your face. Um, if your brows start to look too thick, um, you want to skip the morning application and only apply them at night. So for the best results, you only would want to apply this on bare, thin, and overplucked areas. You want to coat the brows evenly, trying to wiggle the brush through the hairs, and you allow the product to fully absorb before applying any makeup. So you can use this pre-makeup um, and with makeup, which is really, really cool. I My brows are filled in right now, but they do have some patches I may try to fill in. And my mom also kind of has some brow parts that maybe she'll want to fill in, so maybe I'll give this to her but very, very cool products. Again, I do have that 15% off coupon code that you can use on either of these products or any of their other products. They've got hand creams, foot creams, all sorts of face care products, um, lip products, so many really awesome products. I got some SPFs. So if you're looking for some skincare, I definitely recommend them. And finally, I have a new pepper bra. Um, I've done it. I've shown a pepper bra on this channel before that one was sent to me free for review. This one I paid for with my own money because I love that bra so much. So if you're unfamiliar with pepper, they are a bra company that caters to the itty bitty titty committee. <laughs> um, they are designed for individuals with smaller breasts because a lot of bras on the market do not cater towards itty bitties. Um, and so they're meant to fit a lot better. So last time I got this bra here, which is, it's not wired. It's super duper comfortable. I love this bra. They have really pretty different colors that you can get it in. I went for more of a neutral tone just cause I can wear it with everything. But that was the bra I got last time. This time I wanted to try a wired bra. Um, these are both in the color Sienna Rose. If you like the color, I will link it down below. I do have a coupon code with them, even though I paid for this, this bra with my own money. I do have a coupon code where you can get 10% off your um, order. It's Katrina S. So I'll put that down in the description box below. I love kind of the mesh on it. This one is wired, so it's not as comfortable as this bra, but I wanted a bra that was a little bit more like a grown-up bra, I guess. Um, and it just fits. There's not that like, you know, when you bend over, sometimes if you have smaller boobs and the cups don't fit right, you get that like gap and you can basically like see everything. And this doesn't have that. It's super cute. It's super comfortable. They come in a lot of really pretty neutral colors. And when I say neutral, it's not just like my skin tone neutral. They have darker skin complexion neutrals. They're obviously called different things. They have a really fun like pistachio color out right now. If you want like to play with some different colors, I actually think they just came out with a new style of bra that I kind of want to get to. So I really love these bras. They've been a game changer 
for me. Um, so if you have little itty bitties like me, then definitely check them out. If you need sizing advice, um, you can reach out to them. They have contact for that. Um, they also employ women and single mothers. They pay fair wages and benefits and they recycle 80% of their fabric waste and other goods, which is really, really awesome. Um, these are made in Colombia, but um, I really, really love these. I get a size 34A, but they have obviously different sizes if you're interested in signing up. So that is everything in this week's subscription box Sunday video. Definitely let me know your thoughts down in the comments below. This is a really, really fun video. I'm trying to think, what are my favorite products? I love the sticky notes. I love that lemonade lip balm from the Lips and Lather. So I'm like looking at everything. Um, the lip balm from Medusa's makeup, the Foxy Bay smelled so, so good. Um, the candle and Bella box. Um, some of the snacks in the 180 degree box were really yummy. So definitely let me know your thoughts down in the comments below. What did you think of all the boxes I unboxed this week? What do you think of the products? Definitely let me know what was your favorite box? What were your favorite products in the video? I definitely want to hear that down in the comments below and I will see you in my next video.